Hey guys, my name is Isabella and welcome to my ASMR channel. So before we get into today's video, I just wanted to mention a couple of things. First, I have a Patreon where for $3 a month, you can get four extra ASMR videos each and every month, along with instant access to every ASMR video I have ever posted over there. I also have an OnlyFans that you can check out, and if you're looking for a custom video, you can check out my Wizio page. And last but not least, if you'd like to follow me on Instagram, you can do so by clicking the link tree link in my description box and you can use that same link tree link to check out all of the other things that I mentioned but now let's get into today's video So you got my note. Good. I wasn't a hundred percent sure which locker was yours, but I took my best guess. I'll tell you in a minute. So as you know, obviously Valentine's Day is fast approaching and I need a boyfriend. I mean, you would think I would already have one, but apparently I've scared off half the guys in our class. I was just going through my list, boyfriend list. I mean, I've already scared most of the guys into dating me and then obviously dumped them once my use for them was over. I mean, Jim, Peter, Jonathan, John, Christian, Tyler, Jeremy, Ryan, Ben, Brian, Those were just my boyfriends over the past three months. My boyfriend repeated a couple times accidentally, but I realized it's between me and you. And I need to go to my not dated yet list. between you and John C. And <laughs> it's down to you two, who I haven't dated yet. I guess I'll go with you. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did you think you had a say in this? I decide who I date, not you. Mm, no. How you feel regarding the situation really doesn't concern me. Because I date who I want, and the boys at the school just go along with it. You included. And the reason you aren't on my ex-boyfriend list yet is because who would actually want to even date you? 
I mean, at this point, my goal is just to have dated almost every guy at the school. Um, because I'm just trying to one-up Samantha. Yes, cheer captain, prom queen Samantha, who everyone loves and every boy has dated. Well, except you. And... John C. But we have dated all of the same guys, and I want to one up her, so I need to date you so that I've dated more guys than she has. Again, between you and John C. And trust me, you're both equally low on the list, but he just has a certain smell about him that's hard to ignore. and would make dating very, um, nauseating. No. No. That's so cute. Um, you don't need to, like, do that. Okay. I don't care if you have a girlfriend. You're gonna break up with her. Because I said so, and I will make your life at this school a living hell if you don't date me. I also have this really sharp pen that I'm not afraid to poke in your eyeball. If that doesn't convince you. No, seriously. Look how close I'm willing to get to your eyeball. Are you sure you want to mess with me? Did I pass? Let me see. I'm trying to figure out after you. Do I bother dating John C after you? I don't think I can bring myself to do that. I mean, even the thought of dating you is nauseating, but here's a list of things you're going to have to buy now that you're my boyfriend. Um, especially with Valentine's Day coming up, you basically have the most important boyfriend duties out of all boyfriends. Um, hmm. These are non-negotiable items. These are things that I need from you since you're my boyfriend. I'm going to call this your boyfriend duties, um, and I'm going to put dates where I need all these things by. So some of these are Valentine's specific. Some of these things I need tomorrow. And then the last thing.
Don't worry, I'll run through everything with you so you don't have any chance of screwing it up. So, first on the boyfriend's boyfriend duties list, roses. On Valentine's Day, I want you to deliver them to me in the cafeteria in front of everyone. Second is chocolates. Um, also on Valentine's Day, I also want a necklace, nothing cheap, and a ring. Don't get me a matching set. Take the time to find something beautiful, vintage, unique, and expensive. So, no set. <laughs> and I will be getting them appraised to make sure they're real. I need a dress for the Valentine's dance, and I'll need that by February 1st in case I don't like it or I need to make alterations. Um, and I'll send you pics later of, like, styles I like. I need lunch money. Um, I think my boyfriend should buy me lunch. I don't think that's too much to ask. Obviously, lunch period just happened, so you're off for today, but tomorrow I will expect lunch money, and I do buy dessert at lunch, so I'll, I'll need, you know, more than just, like, a standard meal. Um, an eyeshadow palette. I really want a new eyeshadow palette. I'll need that by tomorrow. I want one from Sephora, so don't be getting me some cheap CVS eyeshadow palette. We need a couple song. Don't pick something overly sappy, but something that I can like brag about, like how cute you are, that like you said the song reminds you of me. Something romantic. But again, nothing that'll make me throw up. I need that picked out by the end of the week. I want a puppy. My parents won't let me get one, um, so it'll need to live at your house. Um, something small that doesn't shed. I need that by February 1st. Um, schedule some dates for us at, like, cute spots where I can take, like, cute Insta pics. So, work on that. Um, post me on your Instagram story. I need to approve the picture and caption, though. And that needs to be done by the end of today. Here you go. Don't lose this because it's like your lifeline. Um, and you might want to memorize it because they're late test. Here, let me take a picture of myself now. You can post this on your story. I recommend the caption, my beautiful girl, um, no filter, and tag me in it so I can repost it. What's your phone number? Okay. I don't even, what's your Instagram handle? Like, why would I even follow you? We might need to change that. Okay. Super. Well, that's all I need from you for now. Um, we should probably, like, kiss... I mean, make it official. Do you like, what did you have for lunch? Okay, that works. Well, there aren't that many people in the hallway right now. We need to wait until someone like super gossipy walks by, they'll spread the word. And then Samantha will know I beat her. So, like, what's your last name? Cool. Oh, 
I don't even know John C's last name. I just know it starts with a C. <laughs> well, I don't know, but I definitely would never want that last name, so we're definitely not. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, like I think I want to take my husband's last name, but I could never have that last name, so marriage is off the table for us. Mm, which probably comes as no surprise, but I just wanted to let you know. Even if I did like you, I couldn't have that last name. Oh. Kimberly. She's coming out of class right now. She's the perfect person to win the circus. Hi, Kimberly. she runs that gossip column for the school, so mission accomplished you can go now um, let me see this come back I have play rehearsal, I don't know if you heard I'm the star of this spring's play um, so I'm going to be at the school late rehearsing my lines Come back here when you have my eyeshadow palette and you've scheduled some dates. Preferably, I'd like my lunch money today for tomorrow because I don't want to have to like look for you at lunch and you're not you're not gonna sit with me at lunch. Oh, also, break up with your girlfriend. Oh duh. I keep forgetting that. That is not up for discussion. What's her name? Abby? Well, go tell Abby she's single. <laughs> okay, I'll go tell Abby she's single. Where is she? Is that her? Coming down the hall right now? Just shut up, unless you want your eyeball poked out with this pen. Hi, Abby. You're single. Bye. No, no, no. Don't talk to him. He's mine now. Bye. You go after her, I poke your eye out. That's what I thought. <laughs> Intimidation's fun. Okay. Well, I have things to do. Um, so, shoo, remember, things on my list, I need them, now that you're my boyfriend, good. Ew, who becomes Facebook official anymore? That is disgusting. No, we're not going to do that. That kiss wasn't horrible, by the way. It was, like, semi-enjoyable, so maybe we'll have another later on when you bring me my things. Okay. Well, bye, boyfriend. Um, talk to you later. By the way, um, one, two, three. Sometime before Valentine's Day, don't do it too soon, because then it'll look weird. But start telling people in the school that you love me. It's like a big thing in high school, like, you know, I told her I loved her and I wanted to have him before Valentine's Day. It is soon, but whatever. It just adds to the drama. Samantha will be so jealous. All her boyfriends, it took them like four months to say I love you. See you later. Thank you all for watching. I'd like to take a moment to give a special shout out to my platinum tier patrons Maneo, Kurt, Gentle Cloud, Sebastian, 